This video is scripted edited and written by Nihar Dash. This video is scripted edited and written by Nihar Dash. List of the Indian Navy Admirals which is written by Nihar Dash for public domain purpose only. All about Navy Admirals Admiral is a four-star naval flag officer rank in the Indian Navy. It is the highest active rank in the Indian Navy. Admiral ranks above the three-star rank of Vice Admiral and below the five-star rank of Admiral of the Fleet, which has never been awarded or held. An admiral may be referred to as a full admiral or four-star admiral to distinguish them from lower flag officer ranks like Vice Admiral and Rear Admiral. The rank is held by the Chief of the Naval Staff, CNS, the professional head of the Indian Navy, since 1968. The rank may also be held by the Chief of Defense Staff, CDs, if the holder is a serving Indian Navy flag officer. Admiral Adhar Kumar Chatterjee was the first Indian officer to hold the rank of full admiral. The current Chief of the Naval Staff, CNS, and only full admiral in the Indian Armed Forces is Admiral R. Hari Kumar. The equivalent rank in the Indian Army is General and in the Indian Air Force is Air Chief. Marshal. So here is our list which is written by Nihar Dash for public domain purpose only. Commander-in-Chief Royal Indian Navy, 1947-1948, First John Talbot Savignac Hall 1 John. Talbot Savignac Hall 1 John Talbot Savignac Hall Rank Rear Admiral, C. Tenure 15 August 1947. To the 29th of February 1948 total 198 days born on Kent, Southeast England Hall was born in Kent, the third son of Dr. William Hamilton Hall, FSA. He was educated at Elstow School in Bedford and then served in the Merchant Navy before being co-opted into the Royal Navy on his 18th birthday. He served aboard HMS London off Gallipoli in the Dardanelles campaign. In 1921, he was commissioned as a lieutenant in the Royal Indian Marine, and was promoted to lieutenant commander in 1928. The following year, he became the executive officer on HMIS Lawrence a minesweeper and then transferred to another minesweeper, HMIS Clive in 1930. In 1932, he was appointed commanding officer of the Patrol boat HMIS Bellucci. He held this command until 1934. From February to July 1937, Hall was appointed officer in charge, Navy Office Section for the Defense Department, Navy Branch, of the Government of India. In April 1937, he was promoted to commander. In 1938, he was appointed staff officer, Plans, Naval HQ, aboard HMIS Dalhousie. Chief of the Naval Staff and Commander-in-Chief, Royal Indian Navy, 1948-1950, Second John Talbot. Savignac Hall 2 John Talbot Savignac Hall 2 John Talbot Savignac Hall Rank Rear. Admiral, C. Tenure the 1st of March 1948 to the 14th of August 1948 total 166 days born on Kent South East England Hall was promoted to Commodore second class on the 1st of December 1942 2 and appointed chief of staff to the commander in chief of the RIN in January 1944 he was promoted to captain in Appointed a Companion of the Order of the Indian Empire. 3. He was then appointed as the Senior Naval Staff Officer and RIN Liaison Officer to the India Office, serving in this capacity until 1946. Hall then commanded HMS Achilles. Upon Indian independence, he was selected to become the first post-independence Commander-in-Chief of the Royal Indian Navy. Hall served for one year, when he was replaced by Admiral Edward Perry. 3 William Edward Perry 3 William Edward Perry 3 William Edward Perry rank Vice Admiral Tenure 14 
August 1948 to the 25th of January 1950 total one year 164 days born on the 19th of December 1790 Bath Somerset England Sir William Edward Perry FRS the 19th of December 1790 to 8 July 1855 was an Anglo-Welsh explorer of the Arctic best known for his 1819 to 1820 expedition through the Perry Channel probably the most successful in the long quest for the Northwest Passage, until it was finally negotiated by Roald Amundsen in 1906. In 1827, Perry attempted one of the earliest expeditions to the North Pole. He reached 82 degrees 45 n, setting a record for human exploration farthest north that stood for nearly five decades before being surpassed at 83 degrees 20 n by Albert Hastings Markham in 1875. Chief of the Naval Staff and Commander-in-Chief, Indian Navy, 1950-1955, for Sir William Edward. Perry for Sir William Edward Perry for Sir William Edward Perry Rank Vice Admiral, KCB, Tenure 26. January 1950 to the 13th of October 1951 total one year 260 days born on the 19th of December 1790 Bath Somerset England Perry was born in Bath Somerset the son of Caleb Hillier Perry and Sarah Rigby he was educated at King Edward's school at the age of 13 he joined the flagship of Admiral Sir William Cornwallis in the Channel Fleet as a first-class volunteer, in 1806 became a midshipman, and in 1810 received promotion to the rank of lieutenant in the frigate Alexander, which spent the next three years in the protection of the Spitsbergen whale fishery. Perry took advantage of this opportunity for the study and practice of astronomical observations in northern latitudes, and afterwards published the results of his studies in a small volume on nautical astronomy by night. From 1813 to 1817, he served on the North American Station. 5 Sir Charles Thomas Mark Pisey 5 Sir Charles Thomas Mark Pisey 5 Sir Charles Thomas Mark Pisey Rank Admiral, KBE, CB, DSO and Bar. Tenure the 13th of October 1951 to the 31st of March 1955 total 3 years 169 days born on the 17th of June 1899 Axbridge Somerset England Pisey was born in Axbridge Somerset the son of the Reverend Charles Edward Pisey 1853 to 1932 and Geraldine Fowle 1866 to 1949 he joined the Royal Navy in 1912 and served as a midshipman aboard HMS Conway and HMS Revenge during the First World War. He was promoted to sub-lieutenant on 15 December 1918 and to lieutenant on 15 December 1920, serving on HMS Danae from 1921 to 1923. Pisey then served as a first lieutenant, first aboard. HMS Violent in the Atlantic Fleet from 1924 to 1925, and then aboard HMS Winchelsea in the Mediterranean from 1926 to 1927. Chief of the Naval Staff, 1955 to 2021, 6 Sir Charles Thomas Mark Pisey 6 Sir Charles Thomas Mark Pisey 6 Sir Charles Thomas Mark Pisey Rank Admiral, KBE CB, DSO and Bar, Tenure the 1st of April, 1955 to the 21st of July 1955 total 111 days born on the 17th of June 1899 Axbridge, Somerset England he was promoted to Lieutenant Commander on the 15th of December 1928 and served from 1929 to 1930 as flag. Lieutenant Commander to Vice Admiral Sir W. A. Howard Kelly in the Mediterranean, aboard the battleship HMS Revenge. From 1930 to 1932, he commanded the destroyers HMS Torrid and HMS Boreas. He 
was promoted to commander on 31 December 1933. From 1935 to 1937, he was the executive officer aboard HMS Woolwich in the Mediterranean, and then commanded the destroyer HMS Fortune in the home fleet from 1938 to 1939. 7 Sir Stephen Hope Carlyle 7 Sir Stephen Hope Carlyle 7 Sir Stephen Hope Carlyle Rank Vice Admiral KBE CB DSO and Bar Tenure the 21st of July 1955 to the 21st of April 1958 total 2 years 274 days born on 23 December 1902 Orpington Kent England Carlyle was born in Orpington Kent the son of Harold Flamenc Carlyle, 1875 to 1959, a civil servant, and Beatrice Newton Hope, d. 1924. He was educated at the Royal Naval Colleges at Osborne and Dartmouth, and was commissioned as an acting sub lieutenant in 1923. From 1923 to 1926, he served aboard HMS Ramillies and was promoted to lieutenant in 1925. In 1927, he served aboard the minelayer HMS Adventure. From 1928 to 1930, Carlyle studied gunnery at the Royal Naval College, Greenwich and aboard HMS Excellent from 1929 to 1930. He served as second gunnery officer on the cruiser HMS Norfolk in the Atlantic Fleet from 1932. 1931 8 Ram Das Qatari 8 Ram Das Qatari 8 Ram Das Qatari Rank Vice Admiral Tenure the 22nd of April 1958 to 4 June 1962 total 4 years 43 days born on the 8th of October 1911 Chingleput Madras Tamil Nadu India he was the father of the Indian Navy admirals he is the first in Indian Admiral Ram Das Qatari the 8th of October 1911 to 21 January 1983 was an Indian Navy admiral who served as the third chief of the naval staff CNS from the 22nd of April 1958 to the 4th of June 1962 he was the first Indian to hold the office and succeeded the last British officer to the post Vice Admiral Sir Stephen Hope Carlyle author a sailor remembers a member of the first batch of cadets to attend the Indian Mercantile Marine Training Ship Dufferin, he earned the Viceroy's Gold Medal and joined the Hooghly River Survey of the Calcutta Port Commissioners. In 1939, he joined the Royal Indian Naval Reserve and served on board the HMIS Sandaway. He then served at the gunnery school HMIS Dalhousie, the boys' training school. HMIS Bahadur and was an instructor at HMIS Maclamar. At the end of the war, he commanded HMIS. Kaveri, U-10. 9 Bhaskar Sadashiv Soman 9 Bhaskar Sadashiv Soman 9 Bhaskar Sadashiv Soman Rank Vice. Admiral Tenure 4 June 1962 to 3 March 1966 Total 3 years, 272 days born on 13 March 1913 Gwalior. Madhya Pradesh India He subsequently entered the Royal Indian Marine, RIM, and following initial training on the training ship T.S. Dufferin, was selected for officer training in the United Kingdom. In 1932, he was appointed a sub-lieutenant in the RIM on 1 September 1934, and was promoted to lieutenant on 1 September 1937. During World War II, Soman was promoted to acting lieutenant commander on 29 April 1944, and to the permanent rank of lieutenant commander on 1 September 1945. During the war, he served in various shore establishments and in the services. Landing Craft Wing 10 Adhar Kumar Chatterjee 10 Adhar Kumar Chatterjee 10 Adhar Kumar Chatterjee Rank Admiral Tenure 3 March 1966 to 28 February 1970 Total 3 years, 
362 days born on the 22nd of November 1914 Dhaka. Bangladesh Admiral Adhar Kumar Chatterjee, the 4th of March 1914 to the 6th of August 2001, was an admiral in the Indian Navy. He served as the 6th Chief of the Naval Staff, from the 4th of March 1966, until the 28th of February. 1970. He was the first Indian officer of the Navy to hold the rank of full admiral. He is credited with the transformation of the Indian Navy. He made sweeping changes and restructured the Navy, creating the Western and Eastern Naval Commands and the Western Fleet. Under him, the Indian Navy also entered the submarine age, with the commissioning of INS Calvary, S-23, in 1967. Chatterjee was born in Dhaka on the 22nd of November 1914. He attended the Presidency College as a graduating student of the University of Calcutta, graduating in 1933, the same year he saw a notice at the college about the relaxation of entry criteria for the Royal Indian Marine. He applied for and topped the federal public service examination. 11 Sardarilal Mathratas Nanda 11 Sardarilal Mathratas Nanda 11 Sardarilal Mathratas Nanda Rank Admiral, PVSM, AVSM Tenure the 28th of February 1970 to the 28th of February 1973 Total 3 years, 0 days born on 10 October 1915 Punjab India Admiral Sardarilal Mathratas, Charles, Nanda, Punjabi Transal, Saradarilala Matharadasa Nada, PVSM, AVSM, 10. October 1915 to of May 2009, was an Indian Navy Admiral who served as the 7th Chief of the Naval Staff from 1 March 1970 until 28 February 1973. 1. He led the Indian Navy during the Indo-Pakistani. War of 1971 and successfully executed a naval blockade of both West and East Pakistan, helping India achieve an overwhelming victory during the war. 2. For his important role played in the war. Government of India awarded him with Padma Vibhushan, India's second highest civilian award. 3. He is one of the most notable commanders in the history of the Indian Navy. 12 Surendra Nath Kohli 12 Surendra Nath Kohli 12 Surendra Nath Kohli Rank, PVSM, Tenure 1. March 1973 to the 29th of February 1976 Total 2 years, 365 days born on the 21st of June 1916 Amritsar Punjab. India Kohli joined the Royal Indian Navy Volunteer Reserve as a cadet in May 1936, immediately. After his graduation, he was commissioned as a sub-lieutenant in the RIN on 25 June 1938, with promotion to lieutenant on 1 May 1941. During World War II, Kohli served in the Persian Gulf in, in the Far Eastern Theater. He qualified as a communication specialist in the United Kingdom in 1943. He served on board HMS Queen Elizabeth, 1913, in 1944-45. He was promoted to acting lieutenant commander in 1946 and served at the then RIN Naval Headquarters, HMIS Dalhousie. 13 Jal Krsetji 13 Jal Krsetji 13 Jal Krsetji Rank Admiral, PVSM. Tenure the 1st of March 1976 to the 1st of March 1979 total 3 years 0 days born on the 20th of May 1919 Jubalpur Jubalpur Division Madhya Pradesh India born in a Parsi family in Jubalpur Kurset G joined the training ship Dufferin in 1935 where his batchmate was Nilakanta Krishnan after training on various ships of the Royal Navy, he served on the Abrietia class sloop HMIS Clive, L-79, and the Bathurst class corvette HMIS Bombay, J-249.
In 1944, he commanded HMIS Bombay. After specializing in hydrography in the United Kingdom, he was tasked with the planning of setting up a hydrographic office in India. He served as the surveyor in charge, Marine Survey of India and commanded the survey ship INS Investigator. He was the first Indian to serve as the chief hydrographer of the Navy, from 1955 to 1957. 14 Ronald Linsdale Pereira 14 Ronald Linsdale Pereira 14 Ronald Linsdale Pereira Rank Admiral PVSM, AVSM, Tenure 1 March 1979 to 28 February 1982 Total 2 years, 364 days Born on 25 May 1923 Calcutta Bengal India during World War II, he saw active service aboard various motor launches in Burma and Malaysia between 1943 and 1945 and thereafter, continued at sea with an amphibious task. Group based in Iraq, till 1946. After independence in 1947 and completion of professional gunnery. Training at HMS Excellent at Portsmouth, he served for several years as a gunnery specialist, both afloat and ashore. He has commanded INS Kuthar, F-146, and the Navy's flagship, INS Delhi. He served as Deputy Commandant of the National Defense Academy and as the Director of Combat Policy and Tactics at Naval HQ. 15 Oscar Stanley Dawson 15 Oscar Stanley Dawson 15 Oscar Stanley Dawson Rank Admiral, PVSM AVSM, ADC, Tenure 1 March 1982 to 30 November 1984 Total 2 years, 274 days Born on 13 November 1923 Myanmar Oscar Stanley Dawson, the 13th of November 1923 to 23 October 2011, was a four-star admiral in the Indian Navy. He served as the 11th Chief of the Naval Staff from the 1st of March 1982 to the 30th of November 1984. From 1983 until his retirement, he also served as the Chairman of the Chiefs of Staff Committee of the Indian Armed Forces. He previously served as the Flag Officer Commanding-in-Chief, FOC and C, of the Southern Naval Command and Flag Officer Commanding Eastern Fleet, FOCEF. Admiral Dawson was also the Director of Naval Operations during the Indo-Pakistan War of 1971. 16 Radha Krishna Hariram Tahiliani 16 Radha Krishna Hariram Tahiliani 16 Radha Krishna Hariram Tahiliani Rank Admiral PVSM AVSM Tenure the 1st of December 1984 to the 30th of November 1987 total 2 years 364 Days born on 12 May 1930 Karachi Pakistan Tahiliani was commissioned into the Indian Navy on 1 September 1950, and was confirmed as a sub-lieutenant on 17 May 1952. 4. He joined the Indian Naval Air Arm and qualified as a pilot for carrier-based aircraft. He was a graduate of the Naval War College, United States and the National Defense College, New Delhi. He also qualified as a test pilot, promoted to lieutenant commander on 16 July 1960. 5. He was the first naval pilot to land an aircraft on the deck of INS Vikrant, R-11, when he landed his Hawker Seahawk fighter on 18 May 1961. He served as a carrier-based strike pilot on board INS Vikrant, following his promotion to Captain on 31 December 1970, 6. He commanded its carrier-borne squadron during the Indo-Pakistan War of 1971. Later, he served as the commanding officer of INS Trishul, 1960, and INS Vikrant. 17 Jayant Ganpat Nadkarni 17 Jayant Ganpat Nadkarni 17 Jayant Ganpat Nadkarni Rank Admiral, PVSM. AVSM, NM, VSM, 
ADC, tenure the 1st of December 1987 to the 30th of November 1990 total 2 years, 364 days born on 5. December 1931 India Nadkarni completed training at TS Dufferin and joined the Royal Indian Navy in March 1949. He received his basic training at Royal Naval College, Dartmouth, on the training. Cruiser HMS Devonshire, 39, and at other establishments of the Royal Navy. He specialized in navigation and direction. Commissioned on 1 September 1951, he was confirmed as a sub-lieutenant on 16 May 1953. 18 Laxman Orion Ramdas 18 Laxman Orion Ramdas 18 Laxman Orion Ramdas Rank Admiral, PVSM, AVSM, VRC, VSM, ADC, tenure the 1st of December 1990 to the 30th of September 1993 total 2 years, 303 days born on 5. September 1933 Mumbai India Ramdas was born on 5 September 1933 into a South Indian family. He is married to Lalita Ramdas, née Katari, daughter of Admiral Ram Das Katari, the first Indian chief of naval staff. He is a member of the AAM Admi Party. His younger daughter, Kavita Ramdas, is the senior advisor to the president of the Ford Foundation and had previously served for many years as country representative of the Ford Foundation in India. Kavita Ramdas is married to Dufakar Ahmad, a Pakistani national who is a peace activist. 19 Vijay Singh Shekhawat 19 Vijay Singh Shekhawat 19 Vijay Singh Shekhawat Rank Admiral PVSM AVSM, VRC, ADC, tenure the 1st of October 1993 to the 30th of September 1996 total 2 years, 365 days born on 5. September 1933 India Shekhawat attended the St. Joseph's Academy in Colonel Brown Cambridge. School in Dehradun, Bishop Cotton Boys School in Bangalore, and St. Joseph's College in Darjeeling. He later attended the National Defense Academy in Maharashtra and the U.S. Naval War College in Newport, Rhode Island. Shekhawat was selected for the Joint Services Wing of the National Defense Academy, NDA, in 1952, and was awarded the President Gold Medal for the Best All-Round Cadet in December 1953. He was commissioned in 1956. 20 Vishnu Bhagwat 20 Vishnu Bhagwat 20 Vishnu Bhagwat Rank Admiral, PVSM, AVSM, ADC, Tenure. The 1st of October 1996 to the 30th of December 1998 total 2 years, 90 days born on October 1939 India he went to school at the Lawrence School, Sanawar on a Gov. of India Scholarship for Talented Children. Vishnu Bhagwat was commissioned into the Indian Navy on 1 January 1960. A graduate of the National Defense Academy, he was awarded the telescope for the best all-round cadet on the training ship. INS TIR and the Sword of Honor for the best all-round midshipman of the fleet. 21 Sushil Kumar Isaacs 21 Sushil Kumar Isaacs 21 Sushil Kumar Isaacs Rank Admiral, PVSM, UYSM, AVSM, NM, ADC, tenure 30 December 1998 to 29 December 2001 Total 2 years, 364 days born on Nayur. Kanyakumari District Tamil Nadu India a specialist in hydrography and amphibious warfare, Kumar was also a qualified air warfare instructor. He was an alumnus of the National Defense College and was an instructor at the Defense Services Staff College, Wellington. His training abroad included a Deputation to the Royal Navy on board HMS Dampier in 1963 and a course in amphibious warfare with the U.S. Navy at Coronado, California, in 1976.
he participated in the 1961 invasion of Goa and in both the Indo-Pakistan Wars of 1965 and 1971. He was awarded the Now Sena Medal for Gallantry, whilst in command of INS Gorpad. 22 Madhvendra Singh 22 Madhvendra Singh 22 Madhvendra Singh Rank Admiral, PVSM, AVSM. ADC, tenure the 29th of December 2001 to the 31st of July 2004 total 2 years, 215 days born on the 11th of July 1942 Jaipur. Rajasthan India he won various awards early in his naval career and chose to specialize in gunnery. For which purpose he subsequently attended courses at the National Defence College in New Delhi as well as abroad at institutions such as the Royal Military College of Science at Shrivenham, United Kingdom, the Defence Services Staff College in Wellington, Tamil Nadu and the Naval War College at Newport, USA. He was promoted to Lieutenant Commander on 16 February 1973 and to Commander on 1 July 1977. 23 Arun Prakash 23 Arun Prakash 23 Arun Prakash Rank Admiral, PVSM, AVSM, VRC, VSM, ADC, Tenure 31. July 2004 to 31 October 2006 Total 2 years, 215 days born on Anantanag, Jammu and Kashmir. India Prakash was born in a military family and raised in Jammu and Kashmir. He joined the National Defense Academy, graduating in 1964. He was commissioned into the Indian Navy in 1966. Trained as a naval aviator, he served on India's first aircraft carrier INS Vikrant, R-11. During the Indo-Pakistani War of 1971, he was attached with the No. 20 Squadron IAF. He was awarded the Veer Chakra for leading airstrikes deep into enemy territory. 24 Sharish Mehta 24 Sharish Mehta 24 Sharish Mehta Rank Admiral, PVSM, AVSM, ADC, Tenure 31. October 2006 to the 31st of August 2009 total 2 years 304 days born on the 18th of August 1947 India after graduating Admiral Mehta joined the fleet air arm of the Indian Navy where he flew the Hawker C Hawk off the aircraft carrier INS Vikrant he was the flag officer commanding western fleet during the Kargil war Later, he served as the flag officer commanding in chief, FOC and C of the Eastern Naval Command, ENC, from the 30th of September 2005 till his appointment as the naval chief. He was appointed as the chairman of the Chiefs of Staff Committee, COSC, on the 28th of September 2007. 25 Nirmal Kumar Verma 25 Nirmal Kumar Verma 25 Nirmal Kumar Verma Rank Admiral, PVSM. AVSM, tenure the 31st of August 2009 to the 31st of August 2012 total 3 years, 0 days born on the 14th of November 1950. India took charge of the Naval Academy in Goa, and subsequently became commander of a series of Indian Navy ships, including INS Ranveer, D-54, and INS Virat, India's only aircraft carrier. He then took over as the flag officer commanding-in-chief, FOC and C, of the Eastern Naval Command, and was appointed chief of the Indian Navy upon the retirement of Sharish Mehta on 31 August 2009. During his career he has been awarded several decorations, including the Param Vishisht Siva Medal and the ATI Vishisht Siva Medal. 4. He took over as the Chairman, Chiefs of Staff Committee on 30. July 2011 from the then outgoing Chief of Air Staff Air Chief Marshal P. V. Naik. 5. 26 Devendra Kumar Joshi 26 Devendra Kumar Joshi 26 Devendra Kumar Joshi Rank Admiral, PVSM. 
AVSM, YSM, NM, VSM, ADC, tenure the 31st of August 2012 to the 26th of February 2014 total 1 year, 179 days born on. The 4th of July 1954 Almora, Uttarakhand India Devendra Kumar Joshi was born to Hira Balab Joshi, Anne. Indian Forest Service Officer and Hansa Joshi on July 4, 1954. After completing his early education, in various schools wherever his father was posted, he moved to Hansaraj College of the University of Delhi. While studying in Delhi, he was selected into the executive branch of the Indian Navy in January 1972 and was subsequently commissioned in 1974. 27 Robin K. Dowen 27 Robin K. Dowen 27 Robin K. Dowen Rank Vice Admiral Acting, PVSM, AVSM, YSM, ADC, Tenure the 26th of February 2014 to the 17th of April 2014 Total 50 days born on, blank, Dowen graduated. From the National Defense Academy, 45th Course, Charlie Squadron, on 1 January 1975. He was honored with a and quat, telescope and quat, for being the and quat, best cadet and quat, and was later awarded the sword of honor, on completion of his midshipman training, he was commissioned an acting sub-lieutenant on 3 May 1975. He is a and quat, Navigation and Direction and Quad, Specialist, Enduring. His career he has commanded the Missile Corvette INS Kukri, and guided Missile Destroyers INS. Ranjit and INS Delhi. 28 Robin K. Dowen 28 Robin K. Dowen 28 Robin K. Dowen Rank Admiral, PVSM, AVSM, YSM. ADC, tenure the 17th of April, 2014 to the 31st of May, 2016, total 2 years, 44 days born on, blank, after his elevation. To flag rank, he served in various staff and instructional assignments. He was the Assistant Chief of Naval Staff, Policy and Plans, in the Integrated Headquarters, Navy, and then commanded the Eastern Fleet. He also served as the Chief of Staff at Headquarters, Eastern Naval Command in Visakhapatnam and the Chief Staff Officer, Operations, at the Western Naval Command. He then took charge as the Commandant of the National Defense Academy, Kadakvasla, and later served as a Deputy Chief of Naval Staff. 29 Sunil Lanba 29 Sunil Lanba 29 Sunil Lanba Rank Admiral PVSM, AVSM, ADC, tenure the 31st of May 2016 to the 31st of May 2019 total 3 years, 0 days born on the 17th of July 1957 India Lanba was born on the 17th of July 1957 in Hales from Palwal District, Haryana. He attended Mayo College, Ajmer, National Defence Academy, Pune. Defense Services Staff College, Wellington, College of Defense Management, Secunderabad in Royal College of Defense Studies, London, and is a postgraduate in Defense and Management Studies. Thirty Karambir Singh Thirty Karambir Singh Thirty Karambir Singh Rank Admiral PVSM, AVSM, ADC, tenure the 31st of May 2019 to the 30th of November 2021 total 2 years, 183 days born on the 3rd of November 1959 Jalandhar Punjab. India born on the 3rd of November 1959 in Jalandhar, Punjab, Admiral Singh is a second generation military officer. He attended the Barnes School in Diolali before joining the 56th course of the National Defense Academy, where he was in the Hunter Squadron. He is an alumnus of the Defense 31 R. Hari Kumar 31 R. Hari Kumar 31 R. Hari Kumar Rank Admiral, PVSM, 
AVSM, VSM, Tenure 30. November 2021 Present Total, Blank, Born on 12 April 1962 Tiruvananta District Kerala. India Admiral Radhakrishnan Hari Kumar PVSM, AVSM, VSM, ADC, Born 12 April 1962, is a serving flag. Officer in the Indian Navy. He is the 25th and current Chief of the Naval Staff, CNS. Previously, he served as the Flag Officer Commanding-in-Chief, Western Naval Command, in his prior appointments. He served as the Chief of Integrated Defense Staff, Chief of Personnel, Controller Personnel. Services, the Flag Officer Commanding Western Fleet, Flag Officer Sea Training and the Chief of the staff of the Western Naval Command. He was the Commandant of the Naval War College, Goa and served as a Naval Advisor to the Government of Seychelles. He is an alumnus of National Defense Academy and holds an M. Phil in Defense and Strategic Studies from the University of Mumbai. So, this is our little documentary which is written by Nihar Dash for public domain purpose only.